Hello friends, so welcome to our channel Knowledge Amplifier and in my this particular video I am going to discuss one very interesting problem based on the concept of gradient descent. Why the problem is interesting and important? Because the same concept whatever we have studied in our algorithm or theoretical discussion video of gradient descent same exact same concept we are going to use here okay so without any further delay let's go to the problem okay so the problem statement is minimize the function f of x equal to 1 plus x minus 5 whole square so what is the derivative nothing but 2 into x minus 5 because derivative of 1 is 0 now pause my video and try to solve this particular problem using gradient descent approach in MATLAB. Here I am showing you the code, okay, and explanation. So CLC, clear all, close all, format long, all these things. If you want, you can write. If you want, you can write warning of also. Then I am taking random guess. I have told you random guess uh, most of the time we take zero. But here I have taken some other random guess. You can take anything according to your choice because in the discussion I have told you it will uh, what guess you are taking does not matter. It will uh, tend to the minimum part only x equal to 30. Then 50,000 iterations I am doing total number of iterations. And each time I am calculating the gradient value at that particular point of x, m is equal to 2 into x minus 5, which we have calculated using derivative. Or else if you want to calculate using MATLAB, you can use uh, this particular equation as symbolic equation and calculate the derivative using DIFF. Okay, no problem. Any approach you can follow. Then x equal to x minus learning rate into gradient. Okay, this is updating each time. As I have told you, x equal to x minus eta into uh, gradient, right? Same one I am using here. And then end. After the execution of 50,000 iterations, what will happen? I am showing the x value, which hopefully will give us the minimum uh, value of uh, the function corresponding to which x Okay, we will be getting here and then we are calculating the minimum value of the function using that equation also and showing that output. Okay, so now what is the minimum value expected minimum value that is nothing but expected minimum value is our uh, x equal to 5 because 1 plus x minus 5 whole square will take minimum value at x equal to 5 because this square term will minimum value is 0 and that is possible at x equal to 5. Right. So let us run this control A and evaluate selection okay so if i run i'll be getting here in command window x value as 5.00 many zeros then 222 approximately 5 we can say and our minimum value we are getting as 1 okay now see the beauty i am taking some initial random guess i may take 300 also if i just run see same output i am getting suppose i am taking initial guess maybe minus 60 that is my choice no problem you can say okay see 4.9999 approximately 5 and value we are getting as 1 so minimum value of the function is 1 which we are getting using gradient descent okay so this type of questions are very very important for lab experiment related to machine learning uh, subject point of view okay this type of questions practice a bit because this will help you to boost your fundamental stronger okay and this is all for my this video same code will be posted in the description box if you want you can check there thank you for watching